coming to you live from the Upper East Side. And we're on Welcome to My House, episode 12. Can't believe it. Is that guitar here? Looks like we have somebody sitting in on the throne. It's Andre Vesipolis. <laughs> Welcome to my house, Andre. Thanks for being here. We're going to start this show off with a song by the Chainsmokers. Closer. Three, four. Hey, I was doing fine before I met you. Drink too much and that's an issue. I'm okay. Hey, you tell your friends it was nice to meet them. But I hope I never see them again I know it breaks your heart Moved to the city in a broke down car Four years no car And I'm looking pretty in a hotel bar And I, I can't stop No, I, I can't stop So baby, pull me closer in the back that I know you can't afford Write the tattoo on your shoulder Pull the sheets right off the corner Off the mattress that you stole From your roommate back in Boulder We ain't ever getting older The tattoo on your shoulder Pull the sheets right off the corner Of the mattress that you stole From your roommate back in Boulder We ain't ever getting older I was about to say, y'all about to be get kicked out of the house. Okay. All right. Hey, man, everybody, welcome to my house. This is the fullest house I have ever had. And it's only because of our guests. Because most of the people just don't show up when they, they say they're coming. And then I end up saying, oh, we're the audience and the band, ha, ha, ha. But I don't have to say that tonight because we have a special guest, and his name is Mike. Hey, Mike. He's like, Mike. <laughs> so Mike, um, I don't know if your friend Charlotte told you about what the show is about. Uh, I'm not quite aware. Actually. Well, basically, you, you know, she's been telling us that you've been going through some issues with not finding a job. You've been in New York for couple years, right? Well, I had a job for a while. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> so, so uh, how long have you been unemployed now? Uh, like over a year. Over yeah. a year. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's That's rough a long going. time. It's rough going, yeah, yeah. So, how um, have you been looking for jobs? Uh, just scouring the interwebs like anybody, you know? Scouring? Uh, looking for a uh, programming gig, you know, that kind of thing, yeah. Oh, well, maybe somebody who's watching the show might see you. I doubt that. Not really. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, Mike is looking for a job, but you know, also Charlotte says that um, that instead of looking for a job, she said that you've been spending your time doing some other things, like hanging out in places like bars. Like are we talking about bars? We're talking bars. Yes. Yeah, I do. I do do that. That's a true thing. Yeah. Really? Yeah. So you spend yeah. all your days in bars. If you want to put it that way, we <laughs> could put it that way. So, 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 Mike, how are you going to get a job if you're spending all your days 
Well, I don't, I don't, I haven't thought this through. I don't know. So Mike has been looking for a job in bars. This is Mike. This is me. Uh, Mike's been looking for jobs in bars. I don't think it's working out too well. What do you think, uh, Chamber Fusing? Look at Josh. Uh, nope. Josh says nope. What about you, Sarah? Nah. Ain't working out. Nope. Okay. Well, Eric, what do you think? What do you think? You think he'll find a job in a bar? Nah, nah, man. Uh, Patricia, uh, there's your soulmate right there. Hey, now, that's the only job where you can drink isn't being a musician. So, just so you know. Well, Mike, um, we can't provide a job tonight, and we can't actually heal your liver, but I can bring out somebody we know you love. Um, I don't have my microphone. Hello, is my microphone back? We can bring out somebody you love. She's a legendary songwriter. She's written at least 50,000 songs you like, that I know you like. And uh, she's gonna come out here and do one of her biggest hits right now. Lay it on me. Okay, <laughs> come on, out, Valerie Simpson. Holy, holy shit, holy shit. My God, my God. What? This my makes baby. no sense. Oh, she's gonna None sit next to you. All right. Oh, she's gonna sit next to you. You should be really oh, yeah. happy about that, Mike. <laughs> you know, usually the guests sit over there, but she's like cozying it up to you. Because she believes he, in he you. He needs attention. <laughs> he, he, he's special. <laughs> so we're gonna do a song that you wrote for <laughs> Diana Ross. Because that makes sense. <laughs> we That's should happening. be, let's go get stoned. That's happening. <laughs> there you go, there you go. But we'll do, we'll do Diana Ross <laughs> can, can You need to change it to let's get stoned enough to get a job. No. <laughs> That's what it should be. <laughs> okay. All right, well, let's... Uh... I'm fucking real. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, we're going to do this, Jerry. Oh, that's Jerry in the back playing bass um, before the song. <laughs> um, here we go with It's My House, written by Valerie Simpson and performed by Diana Ross. It's my house and I live here It's my house and I live here There's a welcome mat at the door And if you come on in, you're gonna get much more There's my chair, I put it there And everything you see is with love and care it's my house and I live here I wanna tell you it's my house and I live here On the table there sits a rose Through every window a little light flows Books are feeling on the shelf above Cause it was built for love it was built for love, love It's my house and I live here You hear me? It's my house and I live here There's music on the radio And good vibrations won't let you go I put my name ceiling above cause it was built for love love it was built for love love 
breakdown. Can we break it down, Mike? You say you wanna move in with me. You say you wanna move in with me. You gotta follow the rules to get me. You gotta follow the You wanna visit my house You wanna stop by You wanna visit my house To see me Visit my house To see me Sometime There's a welcome mat At the door And if you come on in you're gonna get much more I put my name on the ceiling above Cause it was built for love Built for love Ooh, It's my house and I live here But really, it's my house It's Catrice's house, don't you think? Patrice's house, and she lives here. never sounded like that. <laughs> never. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Yes. How you feeling, Mike? That was mind-blowing. Yeah. <laughs> bring it more, more. Come more. Come on, bring it, bring it. <laughs> well, as you know, Valerie's written a zillion songs for lots of artists zillion, from, yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> from Ray Charles, Whitney Houston, Luther Vandross, Stevie Wonder. Oh, my God. It's exhausting. Barbie Gay, it's like... classic. <sighs> she shaped Motown. I uh, guess, indeed. Yes. Like, yes. 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 Oh my God. Yes. And uh, you're still writing songs. Still writing songs. Yeah. Yeah. And you have a new one on this Paul Schaefer new Paul Schaefer record. Paul Schaefer's got a new album out, uh, uh, CD. Uh, Paul Schaefer and the Most Dangerous Band, the world's most dangerous band. And I've been doing some touring with him. And uh, on that CD, I'm doing a song that Nick Ashford and I wrote called uh, I Don't Need No Doctor. Some of you remember that. And uh, I do it with Felicia Collins. And we have a ball. Oh, I, I, I actually saw the show. Oh, oh, that's right. <laughs> the show it was amazing. And whenever, if yeah. they're, wherever they're playing, you need to go see this show, OK? Mm -hmm. um, can you show that um, album cover, Mila? Are you showing it now? She's showing the Paul Schaefer oh, album cool, cover. Oh, cool, cool. Because I'm setting up for a segment I do every single show and going to be doing it until people start buying records again. Good. It's called the 30 Second Download Challenge, where I encourage everybody, including the audience in the room, <laughs> to pull out their phones or whatever you do to download music. He's ready. I'm ready. Pull oh, out your phones. I'm every, I was not playing. Pull out your phones right now. Go to Paul Schaefer and the Most Dangerous Band. All of you watching right now, pull out your iPhones. Out. Whatever you do to download music, we're going to do this little rant because artists need to be supported. No matter how long they've been around, you should pay for their work. You should pay for their music, right? Ka-ching, ka-ching. So, ka ka-ching, ka-ching, ka-ching. <laughs> and especially download, what's the song? 
I, I, I don't need no doctor. I don't need no doctor. And in addition to that, Valerie has three solo albums on iTunes yep. so that you're going to be downloading as well right now. Okay, right? Mm -hmm. Jay Refusing, are you ready? Yeah. We're going to do this little download thing, right? right okay, here we go. Three, four. Y'all always talking about how bad music is today. But you just heard her music. It's there. You just need to buy it and support it. Because for artists like Valerie Simpson need to be supported too. So push the button. Push it. Push the button. This is some American original double bubble bubblegum. This costs $2.99. Her music costs 99 cents. $9.99 or $1.29. You can afford a 99 cent download. Push it. Here, Mike, they say an A, a that bubble gum helps. Yeah, I, I would, it'll definitely help. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, well, we're going to take a little break and go into a little commercial here. Yeah, Chevrolet's a good car. Drink more coffee, yeah. Drink it, drink it, drink it. If you like broad verse, then welcome to my house. Welcome to my house. Welcome to my house. Herbal Essence. My mic needs to be on Herbal too. Herbal Essence. Uh, Okay, we're back, and right now we're gonna do an original song by Valerie Simpson that's never been performed. Never before. Never performed. Wow. Here we go. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, 
gonna take more time Gonna take more time Gonna take more Like they say, every show has a motto, and this is ours. We're going to keep the music alive. <laughs> 